I see a huge difference in then and now. And I think Harvey Weinstein played a large role in that. Today, a jury found Harvey Weinstein guilty of criminal sex act for assaulting a production assistant in 2006 and third degree rape of a woman in 2013. He was taken into custody following the New York City trial. The jury found him not guilty on the most serious charge, predatory sexual assault that could result in a life sentence. Monday's ruling for the former movie producer is a win for women who opened up about their experience with sexual misconduct and that gave rise to the hashtag MeToo movement. Women started sharing their own stories of sexual abuse, assault and harassment. Some who'd kept those things secret for decades. Tonight, I spoke with experts about what's next for Me Too. The birth of the hashtag Me Too started with one post in 2017 and went viral fast. A lot of people can really feel like they're a part of it. You know, suddenly we have a, a voice um, for so many. Who Sociologist Dr. Trisha Bruce says Harvey Weinstein's conviction only adds momentum to the movement the accusations against him started. This is a sign that, yes, the fact that things can change and do change and that there is accountability for power um, used in inappropriate ways. One of those women is Susan Richardson Williams. We spoke with her in 2017 about sexual harassment in the workplace. She experienced it firsthand. Every time I came in contact with him, he always had something sexual to say. Now she says it's still a problem, but it's being worked on. People are definitely more aware of the situation because of the Me Too movement, and that's a good thing. Bruce says there's more to come with the Me Too movement. This trial is an example of waiting and then eventually seeing, yeah, there are outcomes that come over time. Richardson Williams said for years, women felt like they couldn't speak up. Now, in part thanks to Weinstein, they can. Given women a voice, and being able to say, this is not right. Don't talk that way around me. Don't put your hands on me. It's given women the courage to be able to say, stop. Weinstein will be sentenced this spring. He's expected to have another trial in California. If you or someone you know has been a victim of sexual assault, there is help. Please call the National Sexual Assault Hotline. That number will connect you to resources in your area. It's on your screen right now. Any call you make is free and anonymous.